A grandfather has been tied up and terrorised during a home invasion and robbery at Woodridge. The 74-year-old was bashed before armed men prized open his safe and fled with money and jewellery. Helpless and home alone, 74-year-old Nazrin Din woke up just after midnight to find three armed intruders on top of him in his Woodridge home. When he jumped me and he held my neck here, this one very so here. They wanted money. Where is the money, money, money? They're asking for money. He said, no money, no money. Nazrin's hands and feet were tied. When he tried to yell for help, he says he was gagged and could barely breathe. They punch me. Punch here. And the other side, he punch another one here. The men found Nazrin safe. Inside was $5,000 he was saving for his funeral. They began beating him again, demanding access. Oh, maybe they're going to kill. I can't talk because he's closed. The offenders got a notepad and told Nazrin to write where the key was. With his wrists bound, he managed to scrawl that his wife has the key in Fiji. She lock away thing. She come next week, he wrote. After three hours, they pried open the safe, took the money and $60,000 worth of jewellery. It's not insured. Lucky they leave me my life. It's horrible, you know, that they're thinking, you know, they should be thinking, you know, they got a parents and something happens to their parents, what are they going to think about that? Police don't know if the attack was random. Nazrin's family believe he was targeted because he was alone. Relatives are amazed he managed to free himself. And finally he opened himself. I don't know how he did it, but he did. The offenders are on the run. And they're warning me to, if you report the police, we come back. Nazrin's now considering selling his home of 10 years. He's refusing to let fear make him a prisoner in his home again. Eamon Atkinson, 7 News.